there is a national debate about sure. what it really takes to keep America safe. Two very definite schools of thought, and we have two people who have strong opinions about it. One named Cheney, one is not. Why are we, as Americans, less safe right now because of President Obama's philosophy. In part because of his actions, taking the step of releasing the legal memos that laid out in great detail uh, exactly what techniques we used in our enhanced interrogation program gave, as my dad said yesterday, the terrorists a new insert for their training manual. I think very mm -hmm. clearly makes us less safe. It takes a tool out of the toolbox for every well, future Donald, president. A releasing of a memo has made the country less safe. And so the Cheney family suggestion is now to release more of it. So there, you know, you can't have it both ways. The point that my dad has made is now that that information's out there, now that we have said to the terrorists, here's how we are going to interrogate, here's how we used to interrogate, we won't be able to do it anymore. The American people. All of it was known. Lawrence, all, let me every, hold on, Lawrence. Hold on. Let me you finish. Let me finish. finish. Let me finish. Liz, my you didn't point. let me finish, so we'll Lawrence, play it your let way. Me Go ahead. My point. Thank you. All we're asking is that the American people themselves have the opportunity now to decide. The American people should be able to see there are documents that show the intelligence we gained from that program, and the American people ought to be able to judge for themselves. That's the main point. Enhanced interrogation. Is that just another word for torture, and is that the game America should be in? It is torture. It's, uh, this government has prosecuted uh, people in the past for doing exactly this, uh, but Dick Cheney uh, believes that it's not torture, and that is essential to his position. He can never acknowledge what waterboarding actually was. What's really silly about it is the Cheney notion that it was a very effective uh, program, that waterboarding and these kind of torture methods were effective. If it was effective, why did they use it on only three people? If it was effective, why didn't they use it on the 500 people, 500 people that Bush-Cheney administration released from Guantanamo, 75 of whom we know, we now know, have gone back into the terror business. That was a failure of the Bush-Cheney administration to keep America safe by processing people correctly at Guantanamo. Is that accurate? Okay. No. Is, I mean, you hear what he's saying. Have you been releasing him back? Me, your father said it yesterday. Beginning. Liz, your father Lawrence, said yesterday that 14 percent of them the went back that you into made. terrorism. Lawrence, Let's get the response. I'm not denying that. I'm not denying that, Lawrence. The question of whether or not enhanced interrogation is torture has been answered, and it's been answered legally. And it's not that Cheney or President Bush or any Anybody else believed it to be torture. The Justice Department of the United States. Are you afraid of Lawrence, calling it waterboarding? You this? No, are waterboarding you is of the not term torture. Waterboarding? Lawrence, are you oh, going to okay. let me answer here? Great. Waterboarding is not torture. It's a very and, and you ought to go. I would refer you to Attorney General Holder. <laughs> Why testimony. has this country prosecuted people for waterboarding? Lawrence, Why did we do that? Because they did a number of other things in addition to waterboarding. It was used in three cases when we had terrorists who had information about potential attacks on the United States of America. So the notion that somehow. You know, we should have waterboarded everybody. I'm surprised that that's the position you've taken this morning. I'm not saying I don't think we should have waterboarded Lawrence, anyone because Lawrence, it does not work. And there is absolutely there is zero it's evidence true. that it works. Hold on, absolutely zero Liz, evidence. This you need to let me finish this point. Go ahead. There's zero evidence we have seen. There is evidence that we haven't seen. The White House won't let us see. Fourteen percent hmm. of the people who were released from Guantanamo already have returned to the fight, and that's exactly released why. Released by the Bush right. Cheney administration. And that's exactly administration. why it's so dangerous for the Obama administration to say it's going to close Guantanamo. Lawrence thinks we should have waterboarded 500 people at Guantanamo. It's, I think that's I did not be, say I know, that I know. It's why your father didn't waterboard more and people to keep America safe. I told you the answer that. If waterboarding keeps America safe, why didn't they do it to more people? Limited instances where we had to protect people. Liz, people. Liz, Liz thank you very much. Lawrence O'Donnell, Liz Cheney, thank you very much to both of you.